Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna, and I do makeup reviews, skincare reviews, makeup tutorials. So if that's something that you're interested in, definitely stick around. Consider hitting that subscribe button, the like button, leaving a comment down below, even if it's just hello. So today's video, I'm gonna talk about the Milani Supercharged Dewy Primer. Now. If you've been watching me for the last couple of days, I've been uploading a lot of Milani because they had recently launched this whole supercharged collection and the glowy collection and I had put in an order in Ulta. This was one of the things that I ordered. If you know me, you already know that the word dewy got me. I love anything dewy, radiant, glowing. It's just my favorite thing as far as like makeup goes, like if it's blush and it's dewy, primer, foundation, I love that. So we're gonna try this. Oh, we're gonna try this out today. And I'm gonna just kind of give you like a comparison, I guess, with this versus the glowy, I'm sorry, the Milani Glow Drops. I was gonna review on this, but in the end I'm gonna tell you, do you need this or do you need that? Because they're both supposed to be glow. Well, I know this one's glowy. I will link that review here. But, um, you know, if you have one, do you necessarily need the other? That's kind of where I'm going with that. So I'm going to talk about this and I'm going to cut into an up close swatch. This is clear, so it's not a color, but that way you can see what the finish is. You know what I mean? So really quick, it is called the Supercharged Dewy Primer. It's supposed to extend the makeup wear. It has supercharged ingredients, uh, citrus, turmeric, ginseng extracts, and exhilarating citrus scent. I'm not crazy about citrus scents, so we're gonna just, we're gonna see how it goes. Um, yeah, so let me cut into like the little swatchy thing so you can see up close i apply it on the back of my hand and you can kind of see like if it's really dewy or not okay all right so let's cut into swatches so here we have the supercharged dewy primer it has ginseng and citrus extracts this is supposed to give you an ultra dewy glow for underneath your makeup so we're gonna see now, I've already tried the Glow Serum Booster. This one's interesting. So it comes out clear. Now this is my hand. It's, you know, it has some moisturizer on it. So we're gonna blend it out and we're gonna see how, I guess, dewy my hand looks. So that's it blended out on half of my hand. I mean, com in comparison, it is dewier. So I guess we'll see on my face how it works out and I'll probably use a foundation that's not as dewy just to see if it really does make your foundation more dewy. I don't know. I'm like skeptic about this one because there's no like, there's no shimmer in it or anything. It's just, it's just dewy. So let's see, let's play with it and let's see what happens. Okay, so you see, it definitely feels like hydrating. There's a nice slip to it. And you do see a difference that, you know, the part of my hand that does have the primer in it has a sheen to it. So let's just put this on. It does have a scent to it that I don't know if I really like. It smells like, it smells like orange Tic Tacs to me. I'm not a fan of orangey scents, but that's, that's exactly what it like. As soon as I smell it, that's what it reminds me of. So I'm gonna take some and I'm going to put it on the back of my hand. It's so funny, it looks like a straight up moisturizer. Look, see? So we're gonna put it on this side of my face just so we could see right away. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not feeling the smell. 
It has like this strong orange scent. I don't know. You know what it reminds me of? <laughs> okay. I'm 32. If you grew up in the 90s and you had to take like penicillin, like amoxicillin, amoxicillin, and it was in a liquid form, it had like this, it smelled like amoxicillin, but it had like this like citrusy scent to kind of mask it, but oh, it's, that's what it reminds me of. That's why I don't, I don't like the smell. Oh, let's see if it like kind of goes away. I'm sorry, if you're sensitive to smell, you're not gonna like it. And it could be just that it just reminds me of that amoxicillin, you know what I mean? That I don't like. All right, so just as a comparison, I mean, I I don't think that it's making me ultra dewy. I mean, there's a sheen there, but, you know, this side compared to this side. Like, for example, let me, you know, we'll just do a quick comparison. We'll do the glow drops. This, I don't mind the smell. This has, like, a soft coconut smell. But that orange one, like, I feel like it's going to give me a headache. Oh, I don't like that. So this one, now one pump of this will cover the entire face. Like you can tell already just as I'm putting this on that this is going to give me a more dewy kind of glow. See what I mean? Like, I thought that this was going to be dewy like this, but it's not. So, if this is too dewy for you, you might like this one if you don't mind the smell. I guess the smell has gone away, but initially when I put it on, like, it just, like, it hits strong. Like, it's not something that's going to make me look forward to using it. Um, but, there, you know, there's there's a subtle glow. Very subtle. My skin, it does feel very moisturized though. That they feel the same. They feel good on the skin. Okay, let's put on, um, let's put on some foundation and see if that kind of makes it glowy. Hang on a second. All right, to be fair, we are gonna put on the Camo CC concealer, uh, cream from e.l.f. This is not a very dewy foundation. It kind of gives you more of like a satin glow but let's see how it sits on the skin over this primer. And if you're curious, I'm 240 light, right? Yes, light 240 in the Camel Concealer. Now, I'm not seeing... Um, I'm not really seeing that it's making it dewy. Let's try this side just to compare. Because I know the glow drops. Oh, my hair's all crazy. I know the glow drops does make my skin more dewy. I put on about the same amount. Oops, sorry. I can't see what the mirror in the way. <laughs> Let me add a little bit more, actually. I did not put the same amount on. Do you guys see a difference? So this side has the um, dewy primer. I don't, I don't think it's making the foundation more dewy. This side has a bit more of a glow. So I think between this one and this one, do you need both? No, you don't. Um, I'm not finding that it's very dewy, 
Like I feel like with my skincare and my skin prep, I can achieve a dewier base. I prefer this one over this one. The glow drops will straight up give you like a glowing dewy base for sure. And okay, these are my overall thoughts. I'm not crazy about this. I don't really like it. I think it's the smell that kills me. And typically like I don't use primers. I tend to prep my skin like a certain way where my skin is kind of dewy and then I'll throw this on top to just like take it that extra level. This is not gonna do it for me. Now, if you're oily and this was gonna be too um, dewy for you, I think this would be better. I'm not oily, at least not anymore. <laughs> I'm more like normal dry skin. Um, so I think this is perfect for somebody who's oily maybe somebody who's younger, um, maybe like a teenager or somebody getting into makeup, somebody like in college kind of, you know, you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm not, like, I'm not trying to put an age group to anything. It's more of like your skin type, I guess. So if you're more on the oily side, you're probably going to like this. This will probably look more dewy on you. Um, it's not, it's not really for me. And you know that, that camo, um, CC cream, is like a satin, like a natural satin finish, and it it still looks like that. This side over the glow drops, it's slightly more dewy. There is a glow still. So not crazy about this, but I won't completely like write it off. It just doesn't work for me. And the smell, I just cannot, I can't do the smell. I, I swear, like if you grew, again, if you grew up in the 90s and you had to take amoxicillin or whatever, and it was in that liquid form and they, put like this like it was like a it was a citrusy scent and it like you know when you smell something and like you feel it here and it just brings back memories like that's what it reminds me of so I'm sorry but that's the truth um yeah so not crazy about this I'm still I would still pick this guy over over this so I hope that you guys found this video helpful and I hope you have an amazing day and depending on when I upload this, a happy new year, and I will see you guys in my next one.